high-speed police chase. Four officers chased a motorcyclist for 20 miles yesterday after he took off from a traffic stop. He led them on a wild ride along back roads until his motorcycle conked out. WLB News 10's Stephanie Springer is here now with the amazing dash cam video. Don motorcyclist Chad Wells topped speeds of 120 miles per hour during that chase. This started around 5.30 last night. Police say Wells is a known drug user, and they weren't surprised he ran from them. This police dash cam video shows just how quickly a normal traffic stop turned into a high-speed chase. Around 5.30 Tuesday afternoon, Officer Bruner pulled over 37-year-old Chad Wells because there were warrants out for his arrest in Tipton. But as soon as the officer walked up to Wells' bike, he took off. Now, unfortunately, it's one of those things where sometimes folks make a bad decision to run from the police. He led officers in and out of traffic at speeds of 120 miles per hour, starting off on Highway 319, then down narrow, curvy country roads, and blowing through busy intersections without taking a second look. He blew through the four-way stop sign there, and over on part of the road. Um, and never stopped, never slowed down, if any, uh, very little. And officers kept a good distance from him. In this particular case, you know, we knew that you know, he had already uh, done some physical harm to family members. So if he's going to hurt his family, who else is he going to hurt out here? So we knew that we knew that we needed to go ahead and get this guy off the street. And they're thankful because if he was on busier roads, this may not have been the outcome. And you know, had this chase continued south on 319 and and went into Moultrie, the pursuit probably would have been terminated. After traveling 25 miles, Wells eventually gives up. Or, as you can see here, his motorcycle gives up on him. But it was him being you know, high, on, high on meth at the time of this pursuit, or if he just was tired of running and ready to get it over with or what. But um, he, he went ahead and, you know, like I said, he went ahead and gave up. You'll see he put his kickstand down here and... Uh, Officer Burns ordered him at gunpoint on the ground. Police found the components needed to make a shake and bake meth lab on his bike. Police are thankful no one got hurt and they hope he learned a lesson and gets the help he needs. And Chad Wells faces nearly a dozen charges, including driving on the wrong side of the road and a criminal attempt to manufacture methamphetamines. And he told officers he wants help for his drug problem. A tip